good morning student the remaining part of the previous lecture is jordan canonical form so the definition of jordan canonical form is jordan canonical form is a representation of a linear transformation over a finite dimensional complex vector space by a particular kind of upper triangular matrix okay it is a representation of a linear transformation over a finite dimensional complex vector space by a particular kind of upper triangular matrix okay and the upper triangular matrix is the collection of jordan block and we know about jordan block in our previous lecture uh, that is the jordan block a jordan block is a square matrix of the form this in which every diagonal elements are same and the super diagonal elements are one 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 okay uh, and every such a linear transformation okay this type linear transformation has a unique jordan canonical form which has unique property okay and um, we know that the jordan can the characteristic equation of the jordan canonical form is because every element in the diagonals are same then the characteristic equation is x minus lambda to the power n if the order of the matrix is n cross n okay and if we we know that the uh, block the jordan canon jordan block has one eigenvalue jordan block has one eigenvalue okay of order n then uh, this implies we can say that lambda eigenspace is one dimensional space by the vector this because we have only one eigenvalue then lambda eigenspace is 1 0 0 and so on so we can say that a jordan canonical form uh, a, a matrix or a square matrix is a jordan can a square matrix is a jordan canonical form if it is a block matrix of the form this if it is a block matrix of the form this if we represent a matrix or a linear transformation in the form of a block matrix uh, of the form in which the first and uh, this is the first element this is not a element this is a matrix this is a block matrix first block matrix jordan block this is the first jordan block this is the second jordan block this is third jordan block fourth jordan block and similarly this, this is the nh jordan block where all the element lambda 1 lambda 2 and lambda n are the complex number or the eigenvalue of a given matrix okay and all the j lambda 1 j lambda 2 are the jordan block okay there are some important properties and some important note of for the jordan canonical form it is a block diagonal matrix okay and each block is a jordan block each block is a jordan block all the diagonal elements of jordan canonical form are eigenvalue of a matrix okay all the elements in the diagonal of a jordan block are equal okay this is the collection of jordan block jordan canonical form is the collection of jordan block in which all the jordan block are situated in the diagonal and a jordan block and a jordan block is a matrix of the form in which all the elements in the diagonal are same and super diagonal is one okay for example suppose that suppose that let us take example if eigenvalue of a matrix are 3 2 5 5 then the jordan canonical form then the jordan canonical form because we have two eigenvalue are same then uh, 5 5 construct a jordan block this is the jordan block 5 5 and 0 1 this is a jordan block of order 1 into 1 and this is a jordan block of order 1 into 1 so this is the resultant of jordan canonical form for such matrix which eigenvalue are 3 2 5 5 okay this is the jordan block of order 2 into 2 jordan block and jordan block that is this is uh, that is this is the form of the this matrix first jordan block second jordan block third jordan block and so on this uh, and all the jordan blocks are situated in the diagonal of a matrix and such time matrix is known as jordan canonical form friends we will learn in our next lecture uh, uh, about the solution of the jordan canonical form uh, for such for some example uh, which are uh, which are um, related to the complex and real uh, real matrix okay thank you